Happy Hump Day, everybody in Facebook Live land. Welcome to show number 28. This is April 15th, 2020, and uh, you are looking live at Pat Campbell. He's about to play some good old music. Number 28, Dad. Good job. You, you, you're keeping all of those papers, huh? It's going to be a good Man, souvenir. I got, a, I got a, well, not just those, yeah. but, but my music, too. I have a stack of papers that, that think that I've done. All right. How's our, our Facebook Live family doing? Uh, Miss Hazel, first to say hello to everybody. Goche, Miss Sissy saying hello. Uh, Jason uh, Campbell saying hello. And uh, Miss Mary LaSalle, Miss Mary Mo LaSalle said she can't wait to hear the music today. She saw you, you, a lot of French uh, stuff today. Good afternoon, Silas Fontenot. Uh, I'm going to start off with a couple stories. Um, something got me thinking, Dad. Remember the time you, uh, you came help me? The first time you asked, you said, uh, for those of you that don't know, um, oh, the coffee. So, yeah, we thought uh, this would help wake up everybody out there. You know, maybe some of you watching, y'all fall asleep. Be yeah, we, we thought we could uh we could maybe through osmosis or something kind of maybe you could smell it through your phones or something. Melissa checking in, saying hi, and uh, Miss Brenda Thibodeau, Owen Como saying hi, Miss Carolyn Viator saying hi. So, Dad, for those of you that don't know, um, I did the public address announcing for the football games at Delcom, and uh, one time Dad was like, "Shaq, could you use some help up in the box?" And I said, oh, dad, man, yeah, dude, I got to do, I mean, I'm trying to see and, and announce who's running the ball, who's making the tackles and, and, and announce, you know, the sponsors. That's a lot of stuff. And, and I make a lot of mistakes. I said, I could use some help spotting to let me know who, you know, whose number to call was in. So dad said, oh, sure, I can do that, man. So we go up there and uh, they run a play. And, and I said, dad, who made the tackle? He said, shit, I was number 65. I'm looking on the thing. I said, dad, they don't have a 65. <laughs> He's like, shit, I think it was 65. Okay, well, let's do the next one. Dad, who made that tackle? Number 34. Dad, they don't have a 34. Dad, you sure you can see? Shout, I, I, I really can't see up here. I just wanted to hang out with you and spend some time with you. <laughs> so we, were, we were high, man. You yeah. needed the Hubble Space and far, Telescope. And far. So that reminded me, yesterday, Dad and I were talking, and he was asking me about putting our song list on the YouTube channel we did. And... Uh, I said, oh, Dad, it's real simple. On, on things that I, I post, I could just copy and paste it and put it. And, and I said, all you got to do, Dad, is just go and copy and paste. He's like, oh, okay, I got it. And after a couple of times of having to re-explain myself, I said, Dad, do you know what copy and paste means? He's like, shit, I don't know what copy and paste is. <laughs> so I, sometimes you just take for granted, yeah. you know. I've, I've copied and pasted a million times in my and life. Not That's not your you fault. you asked the right question. Yeah, so... Uh, that, 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 that made me That's laugh, true. dad. And you know, what's great about it. Dad just wanted to spend time with me. That was, uh, I love so, time with um, my children. so yeah, the, uh, community coffee, that's just to wake everybody up or maybe it's to wake dad and I up. Who knows? I was, but, uh, I was afraid to run out what, of what's your favorite, what's your favorite coffee blend pop? Uh, what about back in the day? And then now I know you do decaf I now, right? Decaf and I did a lot of, uh, I had open heart surgery, um, 21 years ago, and the doctor told me to slow down on the coffee. Mm -hmm. So what I did, I just cut out the caffeine, and I don't miss caffeine. Yeah. When I drank, when I drank Coke, it's a diet. I mean, a, a caffeine-free coffee. Now, if I go somewhere and all they have is regular coffee, yeah. then I'll do that. And when we get company at my house, and I make coffee, I don't make. Caffeine free, I'll make the regular, unless they drink yeah. caffeine free. But uh, All right, guys, first question to y'all while Dad uh, cranks up his accordion, which is an all accordion day today, right, Dad? Yes. All accordion well, day. Well, there's a couple of songs I will play with the accordion, but I like to play it with the harmonica so much. I'll do like I did the other day, I'm mm. going to split it. Okay. I might play the accordion first, Okay. And but there's only two songs. Okay. The rest is all accordion. So what is you guys' coffee of choice? Now, this could also be like from a brew house or, you know, maybe uh, some of you uh, do the Buck Star, you know, drive through stuff. But what is your uh, go-to morning caffeine pick-me-up of choice? And go I, I want to say this. I, I guess I'm an I'm a old tight wad in certain ways, generous in others, but tight wad in others. You go at a, at a coffee house, man, you get two coffees, you can buy a pound of coffee. 
Yeah, but you're paying for the convenience, Dad. Man, I've got plenty of time. You I'm pay. Never in a hurry. <laughs> so what are you guys, uh, where's your go-to for your, for your morning caffeine fix? Dad, let's get it cranked up with Red River Rock. Uh, this song won't take very long to play. So I'm going to play another one right afterwards. One that's not on the list. And I want to see if you can name the second one after this. <laughs> Somebody old like Terry Dore was probably wouldn't know that. Yeah. Okay. Anyway. I had uh, someone um, someone yesterday commented about uh, on one of our videos, and they said, uh, you need to get your daddy a mic. And I was like, well, he's already married to a woman named Yvonne, but I, I don't judge. But, uh, oh. and, but I know what they meant. But I want to remind everybody, you know, we do this, you know, this isn't like a, our business. We're not, you know, like doing for, you know, uh, reinvesting in. I mean, this is just us kind of turning on my phone and, and, and just You're playing. You're not and, an MC and I'm not a musician. Yeah, well, I, 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 I take offense to that sometimes. Oh, oh yeah, 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 you, yeah. <laughs> when, they, when they need somebody who could read English. Morris Ebear, my cousin, uh -huh. was at the camp and he said, oh, I was always saying, uh -huh. I love to sing. Oh, I yeah. I sang well, but Morris said, yeah. Dad, I always did think you could sing. I said, well, thank you, Morris. He said, no, I know you can't. Uh, uh, yeah, today's uh, tune is brought to you by Community Coffee. Community Coffee. It'll keep you up at night. All right. So um, here we go, Dad. Let's move on to I've Been Lonesome. Let's get some, uh, some uh, music with some singing in there. Je suis après mon nuit. Je suis après mon nuit. I don't need bow. Let's tell some of you humor thing that Brian please. Oh wait, wait. Sur la rue, 
Sad song she'll see sad each day Your bon ami à your côté Et moi je suis beau tout seul Après pleurer et m'ennuyer Des chagrins, c'est tout, tu m'as quitté quand ta partie un cœur cassé, c'était tout mon jeu. Notre amitié, elle est foutue, le seul aimé, bon, je l'ai perdu. Comment toi tu fais, bon, je suis assez malheureux. Oh, they, they don't. You know I what don't I learned? Care either. Yeah. Well, it's not even that. What I've learned from my years of of MCing is no one really knows what it's supposed to end like. So they don't. They don't know. I, 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 <laughs> they, no, but you do. But they don't. So I, you I, just kind of just kind of go with. It. <laughs> all right. So uh, lots of good feedback. Uh, Miss Marla said uh, this should sound like a, a community coffee commercial. She said, uh, "I'm a community coffee fan." If it's not community, I'll just skip it. You know, so there's well, some people who are, what, to be honest, are if, dedicated. Uh, if there's no community, I'll drink anything. And except, this, except that flavored coffee. There's some coffee that's flavored with... Uh, you mean like fufu coffee? Pecan uh, or... And, uh, and uh, I like uh, unicorn sparkles and all that kind of yeah, fufu stuff. Maybe so. I, uh, I used know. to drink Mellowjoy. Do they still make Mellowjoy? Isn't Mellowjoy the same company as Community or it's an offshoot? I, I, if I'm not mistaken, Community Coffee uh -huh. bought out Mellowjoy. Uh -huh. And then Mellowjoy had to sign a no-compete clause for so many years. Yeah. And finally, after the years came, came past... In Joy, I got that. Hey, Mr. Terry Dore, when you asked to name that tune, he said, I knew that, but I'm working on a rocker. Now, Mr. Terry, does that mean you building something to sit on or are you Zoom meeting while you on your rocker? You you working on a rocker. Are you sitting on the rocker working or are you working on... Like he's knitting on a sweater or something. Yeah, rocking. yeah. What kind of work you doing on, on there? Might be knitting a sweater uh, on the let's rocker. Let's see... Uh, Owen Como said he has a cousin named Morris Bear. Maybe we related. Look, if history is, has any indication, you give my dad enough time, the answer is yes, we are related. Morris Bear was a uh, physical therapist. And my dad, uh, my dad can find it. Um, dad, I have a question. Um, yes. You know, we, we, singing and all this stuff made me think. Um, dad, are you okay? You have yeah, a moment? Yeah, yeah. All right. I'm, I'm just saying it. That, that, you look like you're doing the Stevie Wonder. You know how Stevie kind of like yeah, goes back yeah. and forth and kind of. Well, well, maybe I'll put my glasses on. Stevie can't, can't see. But... All right. okay. We'll move on. No, uh, no. All right. So um, let's see. Let's go to old Danny boy. Okay. Old Danny boy. That is an old song. And uh, I really like playing it with both the cards in. And then I said, now nah, I'm gonna play it with the harmonica. But I'm gonna do the first part with the card and then I'll do the harmonica. It's a very slow song. <laughs>
hearts are calling from Glen to Glen and down the mountainside. The summer's gone and all the roses falling. Tis you, tis you must go and I must buy. But come ye back when summer's in the meadow or when the valley's hushed and white with snow tis I'll be here in sunshine or in shadow oh Danny boy oh Danny boy I love you so Oh, I'm up there, Sounds like kind of like uh, Irish or you know, oh Danny boy. Yeah, yeah, uh, yes. Um, Danny boy. Yeah. Do you remember I had a, an Irish friend, um, real good dude, very hyper man, always bouncing off the walls. I'd be related to. Us. You don't. You remember who? You remember that guy? Uh, Rick O'Shea. He was always bouncing off the wall, oh. hyper, uh, oh. very hyper. Uh, Rick O'Shea. Yeah, from uh, from Ireland. Uh, so oh. I thought that was appropriate for. Uh, you don't remember all Ricochet. He bounced off the walls. Bounce off the walls. Uh, also, Mike Dawson is a start. Do you remember my, my old colleague, Mike? Mike. Uh, yeah, yeah. He, 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 uh, he yeah. did some song requests. Mike O'Shea. And uh, he used to stir in the coffee pot, Pop. He said, uh, he said, I knew I liked your dad. Plain black coffee. Anything else is not coffee. So there's two types of coffee. There's plain black and then there's not coffee. So in Mike's world, that's, uh, that's the two categories. All right. Good job, Dan. Thank you. Uh, you said today a lot of your French songs are songs you're playing for the first time, right? Well, the, the one that I just played, I've been having the words for it, uh -huh. but I never get to play it because I usually play the same ones. That uh -huh. was uh, the first French song I played, uh, Dad, we, we probably have the smartest uh, group of listeners, watchers. Mm -hmm. Any topic I bring up, Pod, they know. You know. So they talking about the whole history of Mella Joy and the whole history. Now, uh, now, they may just be very wise or they may just be fanatics about their coffee. You know, they got to. Got an, uh, you know, they've been uh, loyal to so long, but man, they, they, they've been, it, I'm, I'm very impressed with that. Uh, I'll tell you what, I had two brothers living in Texarkana, and back then, and we brought our own coffee. <laughs> and then one day my brother said, man, you start to see community coffee in the stores, and there was a little bitty section. Uh -huh. And now 
It's full. It's full. Oh, they know what's people, up. People, once they taste it. Oh, they know what's up. All right. You want to hear a couple corny jokes, Pop? Uh, they're not corny. They're good. I bet right, you've got some good These are jokes. just some corny jokes. Okay. All right. Here's a couple corny jokes to, to break it up. Uh, what has eight legs and eight eyes? I'll get it. Eight pirates. <laughs> that's, oh, that's real dumb. Man. What has... Uh, and, uh, oh, and you think that eight, <laughs> eight pirates, you get 16 eyes, but they all got a patch. Yeah. yeah. Oh. Uh, that was a, that was a, and eight legs, uh, another big leg. what has a bottom at the top? What has a bottom? These are, so I teach anatomy y'all. So like all of these are like anatomy kind of jokes. What I, has I, a bottom I, I, at the I, top? I your legs <laughs> has a bottom at the top. Your butt, bro. Your butt, your, your, your ponky. Your ponky's the at the top of your leg. Of sassy, wow. sassy ponky. Um, all right, last corny joke for, for this set. What do you call a fish without an eye? I don't know. <laughs> That's so dumb. <laughs> what do you call a fish without an eye? You take out oh, the eye. <laughs> oh, in the spelling. In not F-I-S-H, it's F-S-H. F-S-H. Yeah, take the eye out of the F-I-S-H. That's really dumb. All right, I'm going to corny joke jail. Wow. And uh, dad is going to move Man, along. You ain't got nothing better to do than, than, uh, than, I know. than learn, memorize I have two, all them good jokes. I have two young boys, and uh, they got some good corny dad jokes. For me. All right, next up, the water pump. That's a DL Minor, the water pump. Did you know um, yesterday uh, a local business called me and uh, they said I had an outstanding balance? No, outstanding balance. What you told them? I told them thanks for the compliment. I used to do tumbling back in the day, you know. Ah, balance. Yeah. Yep, yep. Oh, so the... words getting out. Ooh, they getting better. Words getting out. Ooh, ooh, words ooh. getting out. Um, let's see what I got here in my corny dad joke. Uh, <laughs> what do you call, this is because we did the pirate joke earlier. What do you call a pirate with two eyes and two legs? A rookie. Oh, and, yeah, my and you're going to like this one. What's the best thing to put in a pie? A fork. Your teeth. <laughs> oh. <laughs> hey, oh. living with two young boys. All right. Uh. What you got next, Dad? 
make the world go away. And get it off my shoulders. Eddie Arms. Again, Same I'd like to play it. I'm going to play say. with the... Uh, I'm going to play with the harmonica and first. And then the chord. That's what I'll do. That I think the people that are laughing, they're laughing at me. That's what I... Oh. You, they still laugh. They think there's some good jokes. They nah, laughing. Nah, no, I think they. they that's what they laughing. Some, oh, I think they're laughing feel, at the joke. They're that, laughing at you. That's some feel sorry for me laughs. Make the world go away and get it off my shoulders. Say the things you used to say. I'd make the world go away. Do you remember when you loved me before the world took me astray? If you do, then forgive me. And make the world go away. Make the world go away. And get it off my shoulders. Say the things you used to say. Sorry if I hurt you, I'll make it up day by day. Just say you love me like you used to, and make the world go away. Make the world go away, and get it off my shoulders. Say the things you used to say, I'd make the world go away. Say the things you used to say, I'd make the world go away. Make some crawfish a to fade and pour and, that on my right and make the world go away. We could do a version with the crawfish a to fade. Mm -hmm. Why don't you make that fish fillet? We, we could do a whole version because food, food cheers us up. All right, so. Dad, you know in, uh, in Auburn, the cheek. was that? Mm -hmm. Oh, you got a cheat? Uh, and well, I that's just, all right. I did. I just forget. It's all right. It's like, it's a trick. Remember, like, you had the... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's a trick, Mr. Campbell. So, uh, Dad, you know, in college, I did, uh, you know, some research. We did some different uh, research projects. And um, and one of the, the research projects, uh, one of my first ever, I was asked to uh, do a survey, a survey research. You know, you got to go and ask some people some questions. And so... Um, when I was in college, uh, I did a survey one time asking a hundred women uh, which shampoo they preferred. You know, it's just a little basic get started with research. So I asked a hundred women uh, what type of shampoo they preferred. What, 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 was there a consensus of the... Uh, of the yeah, uh, every single woman uh, said the same thing. They said, uh, get out of here! So, oh, that uh, was their consensus. Yeah, they... Uh, you know that was uh but you know you learn yeah, you learn. it was yeah, it was yeah. an introduction into it research like it was unanimous. into survey yeah so all right um did you did yeah. you get your cheat all sheet you all set all i have to do is uh press the button oh man 
That's like, uh, you know what, Dad, you remind me of like, the, uh, like, oh, you just need a little push start. You know, like you just give it a little, yeah, it, uh, a little prime. Reason, yeah. You just got to prime the pump. No, prime the pack. We talk a long time, I'm going to forget You got to prime. All right, go, go, go. Go. It's about a man, uh, his wife left, and uh, he really hopes that she'd come back before a long, long, long time. And the second stanza, uh, the kids are asking him, Papa, are you Mama? Where's Papa? Where's Mama? And he tells them, well, she'll be back in a, in a b before long, mm -hmm. but it don't say that she ever come back. Yeah. You find a lot of those uh, Cajun songs have like a lot of bluesy, uh, not not necessarily yeah. the music, but just the stories either, and the, the yeah, which which I guess either they drinking or they yeah, courting yeah. around or they yeah. something like that. But that's why we always end on "You Are My Sunshine." We end it on a on a, oh, on, yeah. a, on a on a good on a good note. Um, all right, now for those of you that don't know, Dad was a, a middle school math teacher before he became a principal. So I got I found a math joke for you, Dad. Oh. Uh, why was the scuba diver failing math? Why was a scuba diver failing math? I give up. Well, obviously because he was below sea level. Oh, a diver always yeah. goes below yeah. sea level. Yeah. Wow. Remember that joke we told about why they always fall backwards on the boat? Because yeah. if they fall forward, they'd still be in the boat. Oh, that was a good one. Yeah. Do you miss teaching? Not not the administrative stuff I, of being a principal. That's I'll, a lot I'll, of stress. I'll, I'll, but I'll what about what? teaching? There's one thing that people just don't know. I guess they do, but those that don't teach, you have to work so much more ahead of time preparing. Man, you can't just go in the classroom and say, oh, let's see what I'll talk about today. I can. You can, but you, you're very fortunate. Uh, and you know you're, uh, you know. I don't have to deal with minors. That's the difference, Dad. You well, could do you could do what I could do if you didn't have to deal with minors and their parents and all the things that go not not and I don't mean deal with them bad but just there's there there's and, and a different set of rules. With, you're dealing in college with kids that are maybe twenty years old and twenty one. That's, that's what I'm saying. And the kids yeah. are old enough to be on their own. That's, but if yeah. you're taking a second grade and you're not doing the that, work, you you that, the teacher can just say. That, that's his stuff. That, you know, he that, knows what he, that was my point. My, my point wasn't that I know any more or less than anybody else. Is that my population isn't uh, isn't minors. Yeah. And, and it's tough. yeah. All right. So next up, we got <laughs> uh, on a positive note. So so that song, I'll 
I'll Always Be Waiting. That's a sad song. So we're going to go the opposite and do a much happier song called The Flames of Hell. That's uh, the next song that Dad's yeah. going to do, uh, and that's in French. <laughs> so it could, only, it could only go up from here. Yeah. <laughs> you, need a, you need a kick start or you got it? Uh, I got it. All right. song reminded me of um uh, i'm all dressed up and ready to go when i hear the band play i'm on a zodico, I'm on a zodico. Like my dancing partner i ain't, I ain't gonna, gonna choose got the zodico blues got the zodico, zodico blues. shoe yeah something like that that's well, kind of a write that down i want to look it up and if i can yeah. get the words oh it just reminded me of uh yeah but i, I, I i'd like to play it my I dancing really partner my dancing partner. I ain't good to. All right, you're gonna like this one, Pop. Why, again, on the math theme, why did the two fours skip lunch at school? Why did the two fours skip lunch at school? I give up. Because they already ate. Four yeah, that's pretty four bad. Four is eight. That's pretty bad. Wow. That's pretty bad. Wow. Dad, wow. that's dad's I feel sorry for him uh, son mm. Mm. well they need to send me some better jokes you know send what send me some better jokes then people can just turn off that telephone I mean I'm stuck over Look, here with them jokes I'll tell you that's why we added the coffee today oh, bro yeah. I was gonna bore I was gonna put him to sleep with my jokes today so we knew it was coming um let's see dad share so this is about uh the uh you remember the one that uh the Sunny Sunny and Cher Sunny and Cher Sunny and Cher uh Cher Cherie I got you bib bib I got you bib I French. got you bib what well, it says Cher yeah Cher Cher Cherie Cher Cherie Cher Cherie Cher Cher Cherie Let's do it, man. <laughs> Marshlands and I brought her 
chapel down here Where we promise lasting love for ever, ever, ever more That is why she'll always be my chancery Tell us about your hat, Dan. On time. On time crew change. Miss Colleen Chapman, Mrs. Colleen Chapman and her daughters yeah. run this. If you it's want a, a crew cut, you're going to be on time. I wish I could get me a crew cut. A crew change. Yeah, they bring. Uh, we, I worked for them for, I don't know, four or five years until I had a blood clot, then I had to quit driving because I couldn't sit for a long now, time without moving. Now, Dad, we may have an issue. I haven't gotten any uh, comments in about 15 minutes, so I was going to do our prayer request again where people would comment who they wanted or what kind of prayers, and then we yeah. were going to do that. But uh, I haven't gotten any comments in a while, which is kind of odd, odd. so I don't know if it's... Uh, I don't know if I put them, if, if uh, I put everybody do, to do, sleep do, with do. my jokes, or. Uh, do you think we're 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 recording? Think, yes, you know? sir. I think so because it's it's saying live. Okay. Um, but for whatever reason, the the comments aren't coming through. But that being said, I still want to offer, even if I don't read them, I still want to do our prayer requests. So if anybody has any Ooh. specific. That's why you hadn't been yep. reading the, the things. I you haven't been seen it. Them, yeah. So that's why you hadn't been reading. Yes, them. sir. And that's if why I've had. Them, you yeah. See them. And that's why I've had to rely on my extra corny jokes. So I haven't gotten any comments in a long time. So uh, at this time, before Dad plays his last song, I'm going to kind of start this tradition of prayer requests, where you guys can comment or post, uh, or if if the comments are coming through, just uh, you know, silent prayer requests for for any people or, or persons or any specific uh, intent. And uh, and I think that also kind of bonds us as a family. You know, we're all praying for each other. We're all uh, uh, rooting for each other and uh, we're, all in, we're all in this together. So um, before Dad plays his next song, if you guys uh, want to comment for your prayer requests, again, I haven't seen any comments in an abnormally long time. So uh, in fact, I haven't seen a comment, Dad, since our Mellow Joy conversation. Wow. Yeah. So, uh, so like I said, if I don't get the comments, we'll just kind of do a general uh, prayer for specific requests that you guys want, and uh, just know that we're praying for you. Yes, and uh, I remember you saying those people in some coffee connoisseurs they knew their coffee. That was the last comment. That was the last conversation we had. So, all right, we're gonna go to that's what hurts me oh and by the way sunny and she, one time i was uh at a at a, a mardi gras ball or something and you know they they dress up and they do different acts and uh so they had a cajun sunny and share and it was sunny and chat and, uh, and they, they came out as a as a, a, a you know a kajian uh sunny bono and uh share it was funny sunny uh, that's neat sunny and chat sunny and chat so all right pop you need a kick start on this one no, or you got it no i got it uh, well i got it wanna... now but in 10 seconds, you don't know. Don't forget to talk some French. Maybe you could yeah, tell I'll about know, the prayer I'll and, I'll and tell uh, everybody we pray in form in French or something. Cette chanson ici, c'est Camille Doucet qui la chante. Et le nom de cette chanson, c'est C'est ça qui me fait du mal. That is what hurts me. And it's about a man who is 20 years older than his wife. And the song goes by and says that. They had a wonderful time during their lifetime. They went here and there and had a lot of fun. But now it's getting to the end of their lifetime. He's so old that he can't keep up with her. And he says, that's what hurts him. And he says, one day he's telling his wife, when I die, I'd like for you to come to my, my, my casket and ha have all the memories of the good times we had. And... Uh, but that's what that's about. And Mr. Cammy was uh, uh did radio too, right? Yeah, oh yeah, he still does yeah. on the uh, on the K R O F on the weekends. He does some awesome. French shows. Awesome, Cammy do say. Yeah, Cammy do say.
uh, he had a stroke. He had a daughter that used to work, or might still work at Red Laurel's. Mm -hmm. When I go there often, I, I talk to her. Yes, and that's during the time her daddy had a stroke. Well, that's been a long right. time ago. So we're going to dedicate this song to Mr. Cammy. Yeah. Oh, I might not do a good job on it for him, but he do my best. getting any comments but but hey that's okay this this is learning you know what this does these kind of experiences makes me appreciate you know as a scientist you need to compare things you know with without and so it shows me the value of our participation with our people out there you know because a, a lot of what we talk about is what they post and kind of having some um but i have a quick question for you unless you got something on your mind that you need to get out I saw All the I wanted to say is that I've been thinking about this, not that I spend a lot of time, but I'm wondering that, I was wondering one day we'd get up and Wi-Fi wouldn't be on and we couldn't bring the thing at 3 o'clock. Yeah. So, um, but it hadn't happened yet. No, maybe. no, Wi-Fi yeah. pretty consistent. Oh, yeah. My question to you, Dad, is uh, growing up, was there, what, what, was there any um, technological advancement that you saw for the first time that you were just like, wow, whether it, maybe the first time you saw a microwave or maybe it was the first time you saw, uh, you know, uh, some kind My of electronic device that you were just like, I mean, really blown away from, uh, from its uh, newness to... Yeah. Well, a uh, microwave was definitely one, but, you know, uh, cell phones, I remember that... Uh, you had to call long distance, you had to get on the landline. Now, I don't remember when the f telephones first came out. I remember the first time we had a phone, but you know, they, they were out. Uh, it was something, you know, you had a car, you could see a big antenna, and they had some CBs to talk to each other. And that was a range of about maybe three miles yeah. or something like that. And then with the VHF radios, man, you could get even further. Uh -huh but still not all that far. And now with cell phones, I, I, I remember, well, and then you had a pager. Oh, oh I need to get to a phone yeah, to call so-and-so. So, yeah. so that was What about a, a TV? Day. When do you recall your I remember your first a time. TV when I was in about the first or second grade. We'd go, in fact, I think maybe Tadpole Gidry's sisters might be listening. Uh, we went to Tadpole's mom and daddy, Ronnie Gidry's, what, what his name is, 
they lived in Mutal Cove and they had a television. And I was asking Tadpole, I said, at school, I said, Tadpole, I said, ha. No, he said, you can see the people. <laughs> what? <laughs> It's like there. magic. Oh, yeah, yeah, that had to be, I mean, that's some wizardry stuff. I mean, that's that's incredible, Ted. Yep, so, yep. well, good. Thank you for sharing that. Dad. Like I said, all the comments, I'm not getting anything, so uh, so I can't interact with our people. Uh, yeah, let's uh, let's do uh, You Are My Sunshine, and uh, today we'll wrap it up a little early. But 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 again, that, that teaches me the value of our interaction with, with everybody. You know, that's... Uh, that's 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 definitely what makes the show is us being able to interact with everyone. So, all right, guys, uh, I know y'all can't respond, but uh, know this is this song goes out to all of you guys that are uh, listening uh, to us on the regular, and uh, our prayers are with you guys today. Bye-bye.